Welcome back to Newbie Views. This week we have an unboxing. Haven't had one for a while, thought it would be a good time. Today in 2022, we are looking at a very popular Rode microphone. Comes from Australia, made in Australia. Yay, thumbs up. This one is the Rode Micro. It is a compact on-camera microphone. You could also play, plug it into an iPhone. You could also probably plug it into a Android phone of some sort. Google, not sponsored. But its main use is going to be for a digital camera of some sort. This one's not digital, but it's a camera. And it mounts on a hot shoe. So, let's go in for a quick close-up. It's all made of plastic. It has a two-year warranty. This is great because this does not require any power, so you're not going to get cut off if the battery dies and you're going to lose recording sound. It's pretty small, and it does have the uh, Rycote Lyra suspension mount included. You know, this is about $100, so it's quite expensive in Canadian terms. And uh, just a close-up of it, it's compact, it's got a two-year warranty, and it's got the shock mount. So It's got a nice little cable that connects via your microphone jack on your cameras or your phones. It does have a windscreen, I hope. Hopefully the dead cat's in there. It looks like it's in there. Alright, so that's it for the box. Oh, I want to proudly show you. It says, designed and made in Australia. You guys are good. And since this is uh, the Canadian version, if we have any issues, we actually don't go back to roads. We follow our Canadian contacts. So just kind of let you guys know. All right. All right. Let's get this unboxed. I'm going to borrow my... Ooh. Yeah. I'm going to borrow somebody's Swiss Army. Let's cut this open. All right. Try to cut it open. Should do it. Oh, there we go. Let's not use that end. Let's just pretend I'm doing it on this end. All right. So what's in the box? Ah, oh, hopefully you can see that. There is a fuzzy cat, a dead cat. That dead cat basically is put on the microphone to lessen the wind noise. All right, so on first appearance as we pull it out, nothing else left in the box. I'll leave that out for good looks. So, comes a very well insulated case Woo! I don't know if you can see this this uh, dead cat is uh, extremely fuzzy and it's big it really surprised me I've never seen this before this thing is huge. This is the size, I would say, of a large tennis ball. Here's the microphone. It says road. Now this could get in the way of some small compact DSLRs, mirrorless ones. But how you pull this out is you simply pull it out. 
and there's the microphone and there's that rubber gasket hmm Uh, it's very soft. I, I, I mean, here's a microphone. This is all metal. There's nothing plastic about this. You've got your microphone mounts. Sorry, you got your microphone holes here. Got the road logo with the gold standard on it. Video Micro, made in Australia, mites. And then you've got your 1 8 jack. So let's, this thing is huge. I can't get over how big this is. Oops, power failure. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, the cat, it's really big. Hopefully it doesn't block your viewfinder. And then this little microphone. And let's put that back in. It's got a little O-ring here so it seats as soon as I get to it. Yeah, it seats just right onto the lip. There's a lip. There's a lip on here and it just seats there. All right. So that's the microphone. Next. Oh, a desiccant. Don't let your pets eat that. All right, next. Here we have the Rycoat shock mount. Basically, this would isolate the microphone as soon as I get it on. Isolate the microphone from any shocks. And of course, at the end of it, you've got a standard hot shoe. This is a non-contact hot shoe. It's plastic. It will go onto a camera, for instance. A hot shoe. Make sure it's open. You would mount it, and you would lock it into place. And there you go. This also could be on a light stand, of course. So let's leave this here. Next, the only connector you need is in the bag. This is a TRS. So this will work on digital cameras video cameras and so forth and you would insert it here and this would go into your camera beyond that what do we have in the looks like we've got a little quick start guide unfortunately I already showed you everything you need to know If it says if you register online, I don't know if this actually works for Canada, but register online. There you go. You got your windshield. You got the mount. Hot shoe. So, looking at this instruction, uh, there's nothing I haven't told you already about. You got the dead cat, the windscreen, you got the mount itself, you got your connector cord. And then snapping in the microphone in to the shock mount. Wow, pretty detailed for something that's this simple. And in different languages. And tells you how to tighten up your hot shoe, connects it into your camera, connect to any, any tripod mount. Sorry, you can use and adjust the microphone sound level in the camera itself. All right, so that is all, folks. 
that was the review and unboxing of the Rode Video Micro. Now, I have a microphone on the camera right now. I'm actually going to unplug it, and I'm going to plug this one in to see if it makes any difference. So hang on tight. This is going to be super live. Sorry about that, guys. All right, guys, so now the sound is being recorded by the Rode Video Micro. Now, I'm going to try and touch this or shake it, and I want to see if there's any difference. And if there is, uh, we'll be the first to find out because I don't know what it sounds like. All right, that's it, folks. This has been a review. I'm not going to leave you hanging here. This has been a review of the Rode Video Micro. Is it useful? I don't know. How's my sound? All right. Don't forget, guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the like button, hit subscribe, turn on your notifications for our next video upload. And by the way, share within your friends on Instagram, on social media. Until then, thanks for watching.